welcome back to nature inspired today we're going to talk a little bit about um, our cucumbers and pumpkins that we're trying in the field so enjoy so this is plot one overgrown with weeds grass unwanted bushes shrubs and <laughs> yeah we have decided to do some short term crops here. Started with lettuce on this side. Um, lone soldier standing in the field. So we learned a lot from that trial run. And so we'll be doing different plots with lettuce going forward. And then on this side, we have cucumbers. Um, Initially, we wanted to do this string thing and allow them to run on it, but time and the effort would not have allowed us to. We started weeding a section of it as well, time again. However, the cucumbers are doing well. We've been reaping these, I don't know, five rows, and so far we have reaped over 500 pounds so it's not doing so well well not doing so bad i should say and this is reaping email farmer how do you feel about the cucumbers i like cucumbers huh i like cucumbers but you like cucumbers why you like cucumbers they're encouraging why when the pepper and the corn and the bad. I'm going to save the day. It's one right here, though. As a man, I'm going to pick up a cucumber still. Mm -hmm. Just saying. You know, you eat cucumber? It has to be shredded. <laughs> <laughs> one around the floor. A woman alone told them something. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think, guys? Think males should reap cucumbers or just females? But yeah. So the idea is to benefit from these short term crops while we are um, preparing to put in a long term crop. We want to put in some peppers here again first time we did that they were not so good but we learned a lot so this time we are trying to set our own seeds to try again on this plot one so during that time that we wait we're going to do these six week crops and that would help to offset some of the costs <laughs> like labor the lettuce, no? I have the lettuce. I can't wait. Now your men are eat. Oh, So this will help to offset some of the costs like labor, fertilizer, insecticides, pesticides, and other costs. So yeah. So we reap twice per week and it's going good so far. It's a good, good little income. The good thing with this? This tree? Can do this. Oh yeah. We have to bend and look for them. Mm -hmm. Now look at this beautiful lettuce. We call it head of lettuce. Mm -hmm. My god. Only one if I? Yeah, prefer. Oh yeah. See. Nice one. Yeah. Nice. So we will be doing an acre of this coming soon. I think we have well we haven't mastered it but we have learned a lot definitely. So yeah. So even though cucumbers are not they don't fetch a high price on the market, very high price usually, but they can assist with offsetting the farming cost for the other crops. So 
So it's evident that we have to be searching through the bushes for the cucumbers. Um, we didn't put too much of a focus on removing the bushes because it's a short term crop and we figured we would be able to get through it. But we realized that the, the cucumbers on the string, those did much better than the ones on the ground. We had much more bearing from those trees and look who is picking cucumber guys <laughs> so the next time we'll definitely be trying our best to use the strings because we can definitely see the benefit of it Go. Go. Hidden. Mm -hmm. Maybe go on the edge of stick. Mm -hmm. That's more pony. <laughs> yeah. That's right, man. I'll repeat that. And it's not old. Okay. It's your first step on the No. Great thing. Let's put your widows at least over this way. Yeah. Uh huh. That way. I will just give up on it. We're gonna grow up on top of the grass and pick them. We are on something, a frog. Bush one. Pure bush. So so bush. And grass. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No, we're not done. Yeah. Nice. Huh? I'm it. Hold it on. Okay. I'm not rolling there. It's really been hour so much in the man. Woohoo! Put it again. Mm -hmm. Let's see it. No, no only enough. <laughs> <laughs> the thing dropped. <laughs> <laughs> That's the thing about how many drop? Eh? Even about how many? Mm-mm. A few buckets. Yeah. And on this acre, it's pumpkins and cucumbers. Right now. We'll try to manage the weed. The weed's better on this side. <laughs> so that's that. Oh, this is the half acre of pumpkin. So we're told that when planting the pumpkin, we're supposed to skip a furrow in between the ones that they are planted on. So that's what we did to give them space to, to run. And the ones that had no pumpkin we placed um, cucumbers on it reason being we're thinking that the cucumber is short term and so it should be out before the pumpkin is ready to run off over there was recently planted yeah today where we will be showing you our pumpkins so we have about a one acre lot but it has some fruit trees in it which makes it not ideal for planting many things including corns or peppers so 
we're doing some running crops we have pumpkin on about three quarters of it and then we're going to do some cucumbers on the remaining quarter we had some peppers in a section of it, of it before and they didn't do very well so we're not we don't really want to put more peppers in it now but um the pumpkin seem to be doing really well let's show you one so this is one um this is the bottles globe variety of pumpkin we got this from the bottles research station So because we have so many things going on, we have two plots of pepper, peppers, we have corns, about half acre of corn right now. So we decided to do something. One acre of corn, if you put two together. Well, about one acre of corn. Um, one acre of corns. So. We decided to do the lower input in terms of time so that is why we decided to go with pumpkin and cucumbers based on the last time we did cucumbers it didn't require that much um in terms of frequent treatment of the field or anything like that so we decided to do the pumpkin and we had planted some cucumbers on the the bank so we'll plant on one bank and skip the other bank planted some cucumbers and those because we thought they would have been up and out before the pumpkins came but the cucumbers are only now just coming up as well and the pumpkins are already running off and they're already blossoming and we've seen some fruits you know that's the exciting part in everything that we do we really want to see what the results are at the end of the day so Pumpkins are coming up nicely. So we are hoping that the cucumbers will come up quickly so we can get them out before the pumpkins really start to take, take over. Um, also, we don't know what to look for when the pumpkin is ready. So all our farmers out there with the expertise please tell us what do we look for to know when a crop when the, when the pumpkin is ready for reaping because we have no clue so we're going to look forward to those comments in the on this video to let us know also we know that pumpkin is considered a cover crop and it can be used for intercropping so what else can we plant along with the pumpkins so the cucumbers they did well so we're encouraged to plant it again and we're hoping that the pumpkin will also do well continue to watch we have the pest management video and the nutrient management video to share as well and uh, we really want this channel to be where we share our experiences that can benefit others in farming as well so feel free to leave your comments and share your experiences as well with us as we look forward to learning from you continue to like share and subscribe thank you